Hey what's up guys, L3 here and I have some more Brink gameplay for you. And I'm playing as a light medic today, and what does being a medic mean? Well, uh, you should know, but if you don't, it's buffing teammates like this. You throw them syringes, and have those little blue balls that float over their head, kind of says, Hey, I'm buff now, motherfuckers, watch out. And then you can heal yourself, you can uh, inc you know, incapacitate teammates, you can pick them up. So that's always a good thing. Like I said in my last video, I like being the support character. And being light, so what does being light mean? Well, you don't, be called, you don't get called a fat ass in school all the time. That's a good thing. And also, you can do awesome parkour moves. So, that's that's a good thing about being light. Uh, negative side to being light, you can take very, very few hits before you're down, which kind of sucks. But, heck, if you can run away, it's pretty cool. So, the reason I'm posting this gameplay, mainly, is not because it's necessarily extraordinary. It has some pretty cool parts in it, especially towards the end. I won't spoil it, but I'll point it out. But it has some really cool parts, and a lot of the servers are still laggy. They, they released a patch this morning, from what I understand. They cleared up things a little bit, but it's still pretty laggy. And I actually got to a match that isn't laggy, so that's always a good thing. And I double-checked my connection, just in case uh, someone's deciding to post a comment right now. That says, hey, your connection probably sucks. No, my connection does not suck. Um, it's it's the game, unfortunately. But when it clears up, it's going to be kick-ass because I'm, I'm really enjoying this game more and more I play it. But uh, let me clear up some thoughts in my last video because uh, a lot of people saw the gameplay and they thought I was kind of stupid because I wasn't jumping, wasn't running around. I think they failed to understand that it was my first game. And see this little uh, circle going around there, that little red circle? I really don't know what that is, but apparently they can put like a time bomb on you and you die. I'm not really sure what class does that, but from what I understand, there's no way to get it off you, which kind of sucks. But, like I said before, I wasn't doing much parkour in my first match, uh, because it was, was my first match. I wasn't even sure how to sprint. I wasn't even sure how to play the game. I just loaded it up. And it was the only match I could get into that was semi, not laggy. That's why I posted it, and that was my first impression. So, uh, before, you know, I think before you post, really. <laughs> but, oh, well, besides that, uh, the game, my, my opinions of it, has it changed much? Not really. It's not an extraordinary game. Some people really, really like it. It's. I love the team-based factor. I forgot to mention that before. I, I, that's absolutely awesome. I really like that in games. But, uh, and, and it works well, but it just a lot of things in this game just aren't executed as well as they should be. But that's alright. I'm still having a lot, uh, a lot of fun with it while it lasts, but I don't really see it lasting too long. <laughs> so, as you can tell, second ago there, I pretty much just busted my way right up to the top. Um, I'll bounce off the wall here in a second, and it'll kind of give you an idea. Only light people can do that. And when you bounce off the wall, it's actually a pretty good evasive maneuver, believe it or not, because you go a pretty good distance, as you can see right there. And it's a good way to get away from people. And you'll see at the end of this match that I do a pretty cool getaway, and uh, that it was awesome, actually. I, I was thinking about just taking the clip and posting it, but I thought, heck, I'll just post the whole match. <laughs> As you can tell, I'm flaking the team here, but not too much. Uh, that's one thing I would like to mention about the maps a little bit. There's not a whole lot of flanking maneuvers. There's eight maps, but you can see we meet in the same spots over and over again. There's really nothing uh, that really separates the maps away from each other. You're, you're going to meet head-on in a hallway, or you're going to meet head-on like that. There's there's not a whole lot of diversity, which kind of sucks, because you think there would be as much parkour they hype this game up to be and things like that but honestly there's really not the confrontations are uh, usually in one place there's not a whole lot of there's a couple of level grounds like there's a bridge above me right now you'll see but other than that there's not a whole lot of other levels you can get on but still no big it's still a pretty good bit of fun you know like i said before some people will join some people won't and you know you can't have your cake and eat it too i guess <laughs> um so what else to say about this game before uh, before we move on here, I, I don't really know. There's the AI in this game is absolutely terrible. Uh, you have to play challenge modes, and they they're just absolutely wow. Like the, it's bad, terrible. It's, it's kind of surprising, really. So if you're looking uh if you're looking to play solo for whatever reason and just face bots, you might want to think again because it's pretty pretty bad AI. But you know, it, it's I'm still like I said had a little bit of fun with it somewhat, but. They, uh, yeah, they'll just still run around everywhere. They, your teammates won't even help you, but uh, the other AI have like beast aim. Oh yeah, check this out. This was that escape. Had their whole team on me a second ago. I think that calls for a rewind. That was pretty sweet, if you ask me. I literally just like escaped five people attacking me. <laughs> Yeah. 
So this match is almost over, guys. We are supposed to uh, guard this bot, apparently. I, that's another thing with this game. The objectives aren't really clear. I don't think people really understand what they're doing because sometimes it'll tell you to defend this bot, but really you're supposed to be destroying it. It seems like maybe I just don't get it, but it's kind of a clusterfuck of things uh, from time to time. But yeah, uh, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it somewhat. I hope you got an idea a little bit how the parkour is in this game and what the medic's like. And I'll post some more gameplays if you're up for it. So thanks for watching.